guys. I went up to the Murphy. I got this 1980 Jeep pickup truck. And now I'm headed over to Coldwell Banker, gonna grab Paul Grisanti. We're gonna go take a look at, at some more homes. But this time, we're gonna do it in a unique fashion. David Neal is coming down from the Murphy Auto Museum. He's bringing an incredibly cool car. And we're gonna cruise that puppy and go take a look at homes. This time, it's mid-century modern. And that's awesome. shorts today? No shorts today. Good. Good. After last week, I've made a firm resolve to never wear shorts on screen again. Yeah, we scared a few people with those shorts. With those um, uh, two sticks with an orange on top of them. Oh. <laughs> uh, we thought are... they were manly, but what do I know? <laughs> no, they are. You're, uh -huh. you're a very stout guy. You're uh, very healthy and in great shape. What do you do for, for working out? Well, today I did the seven minute workout with my wife, Sarah, and then uh, walked around doing some dumbbell exercises. Yeah, she, she, she kicked your ass, didn't she? She always does. Yeah, yeah. She always does. That's what they do. Uh, today, once again, hanging out with Mr. Gasanti, the, the king of Malibu homes. You like that? Wow, I like that. I don't know. Yeah. It's a real estate. You need, a, you need a crown. Oh, the king of real estate? Ah, uh, no. Ma Malibu real estate, maybe. Okay. Once again, if you saw some homes uh, in last week's vlogs and you want to um, reach out and grab one, a uh, million four for that last one. That was pretty awesome. It is truly awesome. Um, heck of a deal. Heck of a deal. But today we're going to go look at some at some homes, but in a unique way because we are meeting David Neal, as I mentioned. He is driving uh, quite an extraordinary car. I'm not going to tell you what it is. We're going to show you. And then we're going to look at some mid-century modern homes. Yes, we're going to look at it. We've got a Maybe couple one. to look at. Okay. Uh, one, I think, will be just delightful with uh, Mr. Neal's vehicle parked in the driveway. That's what we do, man. It's what we do. We hang out in the 500 horsepower Mercedes and go look at houses because that's someone's got to do it. And it might as well be me since I got the payment. this happen <laughs> how did the, David's here Max what's up Max how you doing buddy uh, what are we driving David this is a 61 Lincoln Continental convertible uh, very rare they made a lot of hard top four doors but this is a convertible where everything works the windows work the top works everything works as it should so the question is does Paul work because he's, he's driving working just fine Paul he jumps uh... in this thing like he has one <laughs>
this house was built originally in 62, then it went um, under the fire in 78, burned down, and then it was rebuilt in 1980. Quite an extraordinary looking place, great pool, spectacular view, and jacuzzi. is 3,195,000 and about 3,000 square feet. It does not come with the Lincoln, just saying. Very cool, Paul. Where are we going next? What are we, what we're going to go see this one. You may have already seen this one. This is one that uh, Brian Goldberg has. Oh, we're going to oh, go I see Brian. Brian, what's up? We're coming to see you, buddy. Some realtor to the stars. Uh, I just made that up. Is that true or not? Uh, I'm sure. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this place we're sitting in right now, when was this built? Uh, 1964. Ah. As was most of this tract in here. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't it wasn't lost in the fire or anything like that. Uh, no fires, no. Okay. It's good. Only but it looks like it's been redone since, since then. Yes. Yeah, recently remodeled. Uh, really nice, clean, simple. Mm -hmm. You yeah. like that stuff? Yeah, I like it. Yeah. Clean and easy. What's the price on this one? 2495. Okay. Yeah. Not too bad, not too bad. This is the ultra convenient neighborhood yeah. where you have walk to the village market, yeah, take walk to your the beach. jump car to the beach club. Mm -hmm. um, or your Tesla, which yeah, happens to be Tesla. there. Yeah. I'm yeah. into electric vehicles. So yeah. It is. Yeah. yeah, cool. For sure. All right. And yeah. uh, square footage, how big is it? 2659 square feet, four bedroom, three bath. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's go check out some of the bedrooms. Awesome. For sure. Thank All you. All right. Good.